Hello everyone, welcome to MDLR Fishing. This is day two with the Right Water 12 from Skiff Works. Weather conditions are pretty bad and uh, we're gonna have some very high winds out of the southeast direction, but that's not gonna stop us from trying to put this new skiff through the paces. So thank you so much for clicking on the video. Before we begin, just wanted to let y'all know really quick that it is sponsored by Shop Carl's. They are an online retailer of gear, lures, tackle, and I think you would be very surprised to find that a lot of the gear and stuff that you're using right now and you have in your tackle box can be found on their website. So if uh, you're curious, I highly recommend you go down below in my video description, click on the Shop Carl's link. That's gonna take you to their website where you can check out everything that they have. And all the lures that I'm gonna be using today can be found there. If you do decide to make a purchase, I recommend becoming a member because if you do, you're going to be able to take advantage of up to 30% off on a lot of the stuff that they have there. So go down below, click that link, help support the sponsor that supports my channel. And uh, yeah, with that being said, let's collect our things and get started. wind is blowing this way so we'll just cut the motor and drift see if we can spot those turds I'm overdue I am long overdue for a fish this right here it's the 10,000 fish shimmer swimmer we've got a plastic rattle inside there and then some shrimp pro cure we're pulling out all the stops going after these turds There's a deep pool at the very end of this. You see how it kind of zigzags and then it ends over there, way over there? That's a deep pool that I caught my 25 inch trout. Yeah. Very surprised. And what I thought was a bunch of feeding speckled trout were just blow up after blow up. So I was getting good B roll and stuff. I just got lucky. I was like, okay, that's enough B-roll cast and then whack, massive trout. This point right here, I used to always catch rats. Speck, that is a massive trout, son. Y'all, I've been slinging the same thing from earlier today. We made the mad dash all the way, what, two, Close to three miles of what we traveled now to another marsh system. Yeah, I'm gonna hop down, motor back on, and go back towards that grass line over there and just drift across the lake again. Got him. <clears throat> Boy, he's digging hard, son. Thank you. You got him with a backhand net. Move. Yeah. Look at that. Awesome on the shimmer swimmer. I knew these guys would, you can count on them being back here in the back lake. <laughs> you got whacked, son. Right in the top of the mouth. There we go. Nice and easy. Shimmer swimmer. Gorgeous blue tail. Thank you, Mr. Red. <laughs> Oh, I got a motor back on and get us over there for the second drift. This right here is like prime zone. I don't know what it is about the particular spot that we're hovering over, like drifting over right now, 
but this is prime real estate out here in the back lake the majority of my catching has been done in let's just say a 300 yard circle around us we got to catch a fish before we leave this one little area and i mean it, it's lined up perfect too Yep. Tagged it. That's a red. What did I tell you? I told you we'd get one in this area. Yeah, he's a bigger one. Oh my gosh, that's a donkey, son. Oh my god, he's he's a puller. Dude, he's like he won't get out from under the skiff. Dude, bro, chill, man. He's laying it down over there. Oh, yeah, baby. <laughs> oh, my battery just died. <laughs> Holy moly, man. You want to use my camera real quick? Yeah, just, just keep filming. Look at that. Good hook set, too. He was he got not hold of that. Off. Yeah, yeah, he was not gonna get off. I'm gonna need the uh, pliers. Definitely a slot. There we go. Get a good measurement. Oh, he's well over. It's probably about a 23 incher. Perfect, right there, son. Gorgeous looking redfish, y'all. Y'all, we're going to put this one right back inside here for being such a great sport. All right, buddy. <laughs> yes, Shimmer Swimmer does it again. Such a solid lure. I knew that I would have to catch a redfish right here in this like general area because it's such a great spot in the back lake. So like not every portion of it is created equal. The majority of my fish have been caught within, I'm gonna give it like a three to 500 yard radius from where we are currently planted. Lots of redfish have been taken here in my past. Let's get this girl fired up and we're gonna set up for one more final drift, y'all. Get to put that on, that's good. She got on plane. All right, here we go. Whoa, thank goodness I looked at my lure because it's given birth to a plastic rattle. Probably got two more casts, y'all. Two more casts before the skiff runs into the bank right over there and ends our drift. And it's just jacked. I can't really catch any fish off of it. And it caught and it just tossed. I know I would have caught a fish on one of these casts here if I could have, but the shimmer swimmer it hit its last leg. So unfortunately, no. Watch the put. Uh oh, got him yeah, right so along the grass see, line. I caught that fish. Stupid shimmer swimmer. Right along the grass line. It's got a gorgeous blue tail. I need you to play nice because I'm gonna stick my fingers in your mouth. Oh no, okay. Woo, he got it in his crushers. That was really gnarly. It was in his crushers. He's like, put me back first before you explain to everybody. He had his crushers and then like, I thought he was taking it in his throat, but then he just spit the whole darn thing out. He's like, get that thing out of here. And that is how we end it, y'all. Thank you so much for watching. Hold on, son, let me get inside there real fast. I wanna show y'all what it is that I'm using. And here we go. These guys are worth their weight in gold out here. Inshore fishing, marsh style stuff. I mean, spectacular lures. Shimmer Swimmer, what we do is put a plastic 
rattle in them and then load it up with some pro cure i'm telling you click that link in the video description down below where it will take you to shop carl's and you don't have to be a member to purchase but i do recommend becoming one because you're going to save big money and if you shop for tackle a lot the more you spend the more you save thank you so much for watching we're going to hurry up and hightail it out of here before the winds start doing their thing and uh, I hope you enjoyed it. If you did, don't forget to click that thumbs up button. For those of y'all not subscribed to the channel and you enjoyed it, please hit the subscribe button. Also ring the notification bell icon so that YouTube will alert you whenever I drop more content. We will see y'all next time. Wait, no, that's my other channel. <laughs> Until next time, tight lines, y'all. All right, I hope we don't hit nothing. I'm just gonna keep going fast. I mean, I know my way. We're on plane. We made it.